Hey guys, Leo Dominic here and in today's video, we are going to take a look at a new project and it is called Pixar Eternity, which is basically a casual competitive football game and has multitude of features. But before we begin, um, this is an informative video and not an investment advice. So make sure you guys do your own research. So let's get into the video. Here we are at the main website of Pixar Eternity. As you can see, the user interface looks amazing and the entire information about the project is given in the documents of it. But before we start the introduction of Pixar Eternity, let me tell you guys that Robin Van Persie collaborated with Pixar Eternity. He tweeted on his Twitter account about this collaboration. As you know, Robin Van Persie is a Dutch football coach and former professional footballer who played as a striker. Regarded as one of the best strikers of his generation, he is the all-time top scorer for the Netherlands men's national team. Van Percy made his senior debut for Feyenoord during the 2001-2 and season, which culminated with victory in the 2002 Union of European Football Association's Cup final. He was also named the Dutch football talent of the year and he tweeted on his Twitter account about Pixar Eternity that glad to announce my partnership with Pixar Eternity there will be 9600 Pixar Eternity 2022 XRVP series of NFTs release in February join them on discord group before we get into the project let's see how you guys can join the Pixar Eternity discord group to chat and how to increase up levels and how you can invite people or how you can register yourself in the whitelist of Pixar Eternity. So first, click on the Discord icon given on the right side of the website, then join with your Discord account. It will take you to the Eternity server. Then click on the how to whitelist. Then here it says to have access to the whitelist, you will need to help us spread the words about Pixar Eternity and be involved in our community. Current requirements for the whitelist are number one, invite 10 people. They are looking for high quality and engaging members and you guys need to invite at least 10 people. So how to invite people? Click on how to invite, then you can see the procedure, how you can generate your invite link and copy the invite link and send to 10 people and invite them and ask them to join it with your given link then uh, interact with the community on the server and reach level 5. You can type rank in to check your rank. You can see many people are checking their rank by typing in the chat rank and it will show you your current rank. You need to reach level 5 by chatting on the community server. Then um, on number 3 they have post a tweet about Pixar Eternity and mention us on tweet. You have to post a tweet about Pixar Eternity by mentioning them and to increase your chances of being whitelisted do these following follow them on twitter and telegram uh, they have given their official links uh, tweet about their project and retweet their latest tweet invite more people to the discord server but just know that all bots or inactive accounts will be removed change your profile and username with a suffix of pixel eternity for example jackie pixel eternity you can get the image in uh, sneak peek. You can see on your left that many people change their ID name by adding Pixar Eternity as suffix. You guys have to do same like this. Then um, boost the server. You have to boost their server. You can boost the server by going on the Dropbox icon in front of Pixar Eternity name. Here you can see the option of server boost. Click on it and boost the server. After you complete these requirements, you have to open a ticket to get a ticket. Then you can send your proof for verification in the ticket channel. Now let's jump back to the main website and start with the introduction of Pixar Eternity. Pixar Eternity is a casual competitive football game. In the game, players will play as a team manager through continually perfecting the lineup and cultivating the stars, building up their own powerful team and take part in various competitions to earn PXT rewards. 
Pixel Eternity is a funny game that combines exciting events with a fun gameplay experience. In the future, it will also have the feature of social network and work platform as well as play to earn opportunities for participants. Participants also have easy access to Pixel Eternity assets and NFT genetic data and allow community developers and gamers to build their team within the Pixar Eternity ecosystem. Now how you can become the builder of Pixar Eternity? Uh, you have to do these two steps. First, you have to become a member of Pixar. And secondly, you need to enter Discord and verify that you hold Pixar Eternity NFT. Once you are verified, you are the builder of Pixar Eternity. Now let's check out the documents. They have given a lot of information about the project in the documents. Now here they are saying their mission and vision in future. They believe in a future that work and play become one. They empower gamers and provide them with economic opportunities and they will create a healthy and stable ecosystem to meet the needs of all gamers from all over the world. They hope to introduce blockchain technology to the world in an interesting and profitable way. Most importantly, they have a dream that football competition and blockchain can be realized. Welcome to join us and complete the dream of this new football competition. Now, very importantly, how you guys can install the MetaMask wallet. Now, the prerequisite to start playing the Pixar Trinity is to have a Matic network compatible wallet, such as uh, MetaMask, Token Pocket, or Math Wallet to exchange PXT tokens on decentralized exchanges, store NFT assets, and pay a gas fee. So how you can create an account? You need to follow this procedure to create an account in MetaMask or any other wallet. Now these are these steps. Click the Create Wallet button, set the password for logging into the wallet, read and agree to the terms and conditions that you guys can do very easily, write or save your wallet mnemonic in a safe place, if you forget your password or lose your device, you can recover your wallet account with the mnemonic. Verify that your wallet mnemonic is created successfully. Now, once you have finished creating your wallet account, you can deposit or purchase PXT tokens and start playing. Now, the next step is how you guys can play the game. Now, it's simple. Enter team competition and play to earn. So, in the team, uh, you need to build your own team before you can participate in the game. And each user needs to have a minimum of six player NFT to form a team. And uh, about the formation, in the absence of other factors, the overall value of your team, the total value of your players, in the absence of other factors, the overall value of your team will determine your success or failure in the competition. So for the competition, each team can play 10 games per day and it costs an extra PXT token to get more energy. Now the uh, important part is how you guys can earn your income. Now these are the ways you can do that. Participate in GVG competitions to win rewards. Participate in GVD competitions to win weekly, monthly and quarterly leaderboard rewards. Participate in non-regular official Grand Prix such as European Championship, World Cup, etc. Upgrade your player NFT or prop NFT and sell them in the marketplace. Collect rare star NFT and sell them for a profit in the marketplace. And uh, they have two types of NFTs, player NFT and prop NFT, player NFT. So the player NFT is one of the most important characters in the game of Pixar Eternity. Uh, each of the player NFT is a unique and you can get them through mystery boxes or official events or you can trade them in the marketplace. Uh, the other one is prop NFT. Now props is an uncertain factor in the battle of Pixar Eternity. If the combat power of both sides is equal, the arrangement of different prop NFT will affect the result of the battle. It is mainly obtained through mystery boxes and trading in the market. You can also be rewarded by participating in official activities. Prop NFT is mainly divided into three types, supply, skills, and weakening. So supplies are your basic value of your players in your team by a certain percent. Skills are your team's players offense or defense and weakening is uh, a value of reduction you can value of reduction you can add to the opposing team by a certain percentage uh, now we have the tokenomics they have two types of tokens pixel eternity token pxt which is the main token of pixel eternity token 
and pixel leak points token which is also called the plp is the in-game token for the upgradation and purchases so pixel token which is the pxt is the only functional token in the pixel eternity ecosystem pxt holders will be able to claim rewards if they stake their tokens play the game and participate in key governance votes players will also be able to earn pxt tokens when they play various games within the pixel universe and through user generated content initiatives with a total issuance of 10 billion pxts that will be unlocking over the next six years according to the schedule and tge's initial revolving supply of 517 million represents only 5.17 percent of the total supply now as you can see the distribution of the token is given in this pattern uh, 30 percent the most is for the play to earn then uh, 20 percent for the ecological foundation 15 percent for the team 1 percent for the public sale 17 percent for the private sale 2 percent is their liquidity and 15 percent is the staking uh, their symbol is pxt and the total circulation they have is 10 billion and the public chain is ethereum chain erc20 now the other token was pixel leak points or the plp token now it is the main in-game currency it will be used for trading exchanging and upgrade one's nfts including their special qualities the native digital cryptographical secured utility token of pixel leak points is transferable representation of attributed functions specified in the protocol code of pixel and is designed to be used solely as an interoperable utility token on the platform plp tokens provide the economic incentives which will be distributed to encourage users to contribute and maintain the ecosystem on Pixar. Now, PLP tokens are created as a reward for players when participating in game activities such as Battle Pass, Quest, Random Events, or PvE competition rewards. Uh, Pixar Trinity does not sell PLP to players directly, and Pixar Trinity also does not provide liquidity for PLP. PLP can be earned by playing the in game. Uh, by playing the game in pve adventure mode as well as the pvp arena once you earn them you can sync them to your wallet now we have the roadmap so for the quarter one they are saying uh, pixel trinity project approval complete project research and technical feasibility assessment the core technology research and development team be established uh, for the quarter two they are saying finish the prototype of pixel trinity and start the development of the beta version technology uh, for the quarter three cooperation and docking between institutions and star players build an early pixel eternity community and develop a business plan uh, for the quarter four pixel eternity is in beta ido started and launched swap defy plate online to increase liquidity for the quarter five pixel eternity mystery box nfts more institutions and star players support participation cooperation start peripheral nft sale quarter six pixel eternity is out in beta Mining pools are staking and ecological foundations are built on staking. Quarter 6 Pixel Trinity is out in beta and mining pools are staking and ecological foundations are built on staking. For the quarter 7 Pixel Trinity has officially launched. Pixel Trinity will be an official contest for eternity. For the quarter 8 Pixel Trinity tries to decentralize ecological community autonomy. And for the quarter 9 they are saying of the official Pixel Trinity contest kicks off. So this was all of their roadmap. Now, very importantly, their NFT price is low only to 0 0.05 Ethereum. And they have given their social media handles. You can join them to get all their latest updates. So here we have it. This is all what I have for you guys in this video. If you have any question, you can leave it down in the comment section below and I'll see you guys in the next